Cap Ed Credit Union. Idaho City High School is giving its students a chance to close their textbooks and get hands on with math. KPOH's Abigail Taylor shows us how it's making school fun and opening up new opportunities for these students in this week's Leaders in Learning. Students at Idaho City High School are seeing trigonometry at a new angle. 15 to 20 seconds, somewhere in that range. It's pretty amazing and it's a lot better than normal school. Using old land surveying equipment that was donated to the school, these students are learning there's more to math than just the problems on a piece of paper. With the equipment, we were able to put together a class that used the, the trigonometry and then allowed the kids to go out in the field and um, learn the equipment so that they could do hands-on math. These students are actually walking the lines of the problems they're solving and calculating the angles of real-life objects like this swing set. You don't fight for the engagement of the student when, they're, when they have honest curiosity about what's going on, so um, half the battle's already won. Idaho City is the only school in the region using this technique. There you go, it's focused. Sweet. Sweet. <laughs> and while it is fun, it's not just about looking at math from a new perspective. If you decide to go into surveying, that'd really help because you have a bunch of experience out on the field. These students will have the opportunity to get jobs in land surveying right out of high school. And as it turns out, there's a huge demand in the field. The average age of surveyors in Idaho is 56, and I know the national average is pretty close to the same. Um, so across the country, it's a very, very necessary profession for, to get our young people into. Abigail Taylor, KBOI 2 News. Now the teacher says that demand for the jobs like this, surveying jobs, well several students have already been told they have a job waiting for them if they want it after graduating.